Welcome back again to another video on G Security. So today I'm going to do a wireless or Wi-Fi hack. Now this is strictly for ethical hacking purposes and for cyber security awareness. This is just to show you how hackers access your Wi-Fi networks if you if you don't configure your wireless networks correctly. So most people nowadays use wireless networks. We have Wi-Fi at our homes, places of work. We use Wi-Fi to do almost everything in our daily lives, browsing the internet, uh, entertainment, and uh, uh, communicating with friends and family. So it's very, very imperative that you uh, strengthen your wireless network with strong password. So before we continue again, disclaimer, this is strictly for cyber security awareness. I'm not liable or responsible for any misuse of my videos. So let's proceed. I'm on my Kali Linux machine. I'm going to go to my terminal. So we're going to demonstrate this using a nice tool called Wi-Fi that is available in Kali Linux, Parrot Linux, and almost every other ethical hacking distribution. We're going to do sudo Wi-Fi dash dash kill. So the dash dash kill is to kill any conflicting processes that might interfere with our attack sudo my wireless network is called tender it has the default uh, name and the default password now i'm now i'm demonstrating this using my equipment my phone my router my router's name is called tender and as you can see here there's one client that is my smartphone so what we are going to do is we're going to knock off my smartphone off the network and when it tries to reconnect to the network, we will capture what we call a handshake. And then we are going to crack this handshake to get the Wi-Fi password. So it has already uh, seen the network. We're going to control C. And then I'm going to select my wireless network, which is 3. And then what Wi-Fi will do is uh, it will target this uh, network with all types of attacks. I'm sorry. Let me do this again. I forgot something. The dictionary file, it's in my home, predator, desktop, and then common.txt file. If I come to my desktop, let's go to my desktop. There's a list of common uh, Wi Fi password that you might encounter. Starting with one password, password, one, two, three, up to nine. These are just some of the Wi Fi uh, passwords that you most found in wireless networks. We have even I love you, one, two, three, four, and two, zero, and this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, which are maybe you're using as your Wi Fi hotspot password, most probably. So take note. Let's go back to our terminal. So we are going to enter and then uh, wait for my phone to pop up. It has it there. Control C and then one. And then the Wi-Fi will start with the first attack, which is called the PM key ID capture. I'm going to skip that uh, attack and let it capture the handshake now. So it has already captured the handshake, tender Wi-Fi. It is a valid handshake and it has only taken 0.01% to crack this password. This is the Wi-Fi password. So this is how easy it is to crack a wireless network that has been configured incorrectly. And by incorrectly, we mean that it has been left with the default configuration of the username and password. So if your Wi-Fi network has been installed by a company, make sure you tell them to put the a very very strong password that will ensure the security of your wireless network don't take chances with your network take, take note that uh, a lot of information uh, goes through your network your bank information your browsing history all that goes to your network and if i could get access to your network what i will do is i will sniff the network look at your traffic, I can see your browsing story, I can see what you search online, I can see all the websites that you visit. That is, some of that information is private information. 
Just imagine what a hacker will do with that information. This is where identity theft comes in. Somebody might steal your information, hold it for ransom, and they might even blackmail you with that password. So guys, take note. Password security, very, very important. Thank you for watching this video. And today is the last day of 2023. So make sure to correctly configure your router. If you can't, just uh, call somebody who has the technical skills to help you out. Thank you and Happy New Year. I'll see you next year.